To get to the bottom of what makes Oliver so disturbingly different, we need to delve deeper into his origin. Oliver comes from a part of Central Africa where traditionally some people live in close proximity with our ape cousins. In this remote village, several chimps are kept as household pets, although their status within the family is very low. It's thought that up to 78,000 chimpanzees live in the wild in this part of the world. Could Oliver be the offspring of some unspeakable union between human and chimp? Could this account for Oliver's strange human-like behavior and appearance? With chimps living so closely to humans, such a union, while highly unlikely, is not beyond the bounds of possibility.